time here, family, and it was a beautiful city tour. I really appreciate our good brother, tour guide Nana Yao. It was a privilege, brother. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. And uh, you know, Nana is like one of uh, several of our tour guides that we have had over the years. And we usually make sure that your family, you get a certified Ghanaian professional tour guide, and all of them have delivered. And you know, want to let everyone know that family, unfortunately, we were not able to go to Kwame Nkrumah Memorial Park because of a closure, and they're working on things they're fixing. Yeah, renovation. So that is uh, new news, uh, but it's uh, go like that. We keep it flowing, but we're able to enjoy a wonderful presentation at WEB Du Bois Memorial, and also we're able to just enjoy a connection at George Padmore Library, Arts and Culture Center, and my favorite part of the day was when my good brother here took me to yeah, the 1957 monument. I've never been on top. So, I mean, I really appreciate that, brother. It, I mean, the views that we had, I, I, was, I was so excited. I, I was all around this videotaping everything, taking pictures. I was like, yeah, give me the camera. I went from the top, went down to the bottom. And then another one I love is the, the, the Lone Soldier, the flames. Then you got the flags. Then you got the 1957 monument all together. Uh, so it was a great day, family. And we want you to understand, when you come on these journeys, we have a lot of documentation for you. So make sure that you open your ears up, listen, and also make sure you have lots of questions so you can ask more questions so we can give you more information. So that was a great presentation. Uh, so anything else you'd like to share, brother, um, to our guests uh, to encourage more of them to come? Because at one point, you and I was talking about uh, the, the adjustment of the uh, the mandates um, for people to come and now yeah. things are a little more laid back yeah. now like you mentioned and we're able to come to Ghana a lot easier now because now we don't have to take any, even a COVID test. Yeah. Yes, um, the people, Ghana is a beautiful country. Arms are welcoming you left and right and I think that Ghana is the only place you can just enter as a stranger to any home and you will be welcome. The person will be even ready to give up his dinner, even though you're not part of the dinner <laughs> celebration. So they will give up their dinner or give up their bed for you to lay. So you're always welcome to Ghana. It's a beautiful country. It's always summertime, even though we have the rains, but the rains don't fall every day. They, they fall once a while, and there's no place like Ghana. Just come. This African you family, one of my favorite countries, and the thing we want you to understand, anyone who needs any information, need clarity, how to come to Ghana, come to Africa, get clear access, just reach out to us directly, because we have all of the right people on the ground, and you are very instrumental on making sure that we're clear about the, the process and the new process and everything, because things, family, we live in a world where things are going to change and travel, and sometimes people think that they can just get up, leave from one country with no passport, no visas, you know, those days were good. But now you're dealing with a world of national yes, security. Uh, it's very important that you, you can't just let anyone that's coming to your country anymore. You need to get pre-documentation. Mm -hmm. That's why visa process and all those things are very important. Mm -hmm. And things that so the things that Ghana is doing, I tell people don't take it personal. Look at it as you know a country stepping their game up to make sure that you know you're coming to a, a country that's growing and organized. And we have seen a lot of things change from Ghana, from going from the analog method, yeah. like even the Lands Commission, yeah. to more of a digital it's method. Digital, yeah, even you, you showed me, I forgot what you showed me today, and you, you told me that it was more of like a new technology yeah. uh, building. Yeah, that's the court complex. The new court yeah. complex. Yes, the digitalized court complex, where the judges, the clerks, everybody um, work without writing, everything is taken digitally and so disseminate justice quickly. So we're moving forward as a country and as a nation and as our president said, you're all welcome. This is your house. This is your home. I appreciate it. Man. I really appreciate the love from Ghana. Ghana's reached out to more of yeah. us from the diaspora than mm -hmm. any other country. So yeah. family, we're going to keep it going. And remember family, visit our website at africaforthafricans.org, right here on our t-shirt, and uh, reach out to us and we'll give you proper information and clarity because the issue that we have is that there's a lot of misinformation being passed around on the internet and individuals and people who are not even professional. You talk, you're talking about a tour guide that's been in the business for a long time, and you're talking about a tour organizer that's been in the business for a long time. Together we can help you do anything. So family, exactly. the journey continues, and my brother, appreciate you. Thank you. Yeah? Thank you.